by giving him hand signals. One-handed catch. One-handed catch. One-handed You're catch. You're fucking idiot. What's up, Madden All-Stars? This is Joe King John City 4, and today I'll be talking about the middle linebacker position for Madden 17. Now, you guys have seen my top five middle linebackers for Madden 17. You should know that one linebacker who actually was leading the whole NFL in tackling did not even make it to the top five, and his name is Navarro Bowman. Now, this middle linebacker from the 49ers was pretty much left out from the top five, and I noticed that a lot of people in the comment sections were mentioning this middle linebacker. Like, I was watching some of the top five middle linebacker videos. And uh, I noticed in the comment sections, people were saying like, oh, Navarro Bowman needs to be number four or number five. Take out Jamie Collins or take out this Brandon Marshall or take out this other linebacker. Like, there was a lot of discussions in the comment section. And I was thinking like, I should really leave my opinion about this whole situation. So I did my research. And this time, you know, most of you guys have seen my videos already so far. And about Drew Brees and about Todd Gurley, Devonta Freeman, AJ Green. You know, this has been large discussions. And I'm usually, you know, against the top five. Well, this time... I'm actually for the top five. You see, I did my research. Navarro Bowman, despite him getting over 116 tackles by himself, I still wouldn't consider him a top five. Maybe raise the middle linebacker over a little bit higher to make it seem like, oh, he's still a good linebacker. But according to EA, he's lower than uh, 90 overall. So uh, what happened was that Jamie Collins, Brandon Marshall, uh, Luke Keekley and Bobby Wagner, all these linebackers had interceptions, touchdowns, freaking sacks, uh, forced fumbles. They had way more stats to present that middle linebacker position compared to Navarro Bowman and Paul Puzlosny. And this, you see, this other middle linebacker, Paul Puzlosny, was also, you know, he also had a lot of tackles last season. But the thing is, he only had like one forced fumble or two forced fumbles and that's it. And Navarro Bowman, he only had one forced fumble and no interceptions, no touchdowns. It was only a lot of tackling. He's a, he's a freaking tackling machine. But the thing is, these other linebackers like Luke Kuechly, like I said, he has touchdowns. He has interceptions, sacks, forced fumbles, fumble recoveries. Like, he's packed in the stats. I want you guys to do your own research too. Like, search them up and tell me all these top five linebackers don't deserve there, to be there. Because they actually do. Because the stats actually back them up. Yes, I know they have less tackling than freaking Navarro Bowman. But the thing is, they have stats to represent them better. Because, you know, of all these other touchdowns and interceptions. So... In my opinion, at the end of this whole situation, of the, at the end of this whole argument, you can say these top five linebackers like Jamie Collins, uh, Brandon Marshall, who has like tons of interceptions, forced fumbles, uh, fumble recoveries, and like Luke Kuechly and Bobby Wagner, who have touchdowns in their records. I mean, those guys are better. They look like they're a prototype linebackers. They can play any position of the linebacker position. So I would consider the top five list for the middle linebacker position correct. I wouldn't put Navarro Bowman up there. I know he has like eight years in the league and he has some, some some kind of experience, but still, these other linebackers are rising up and some of them have also been playing consistently over the years. So uh, the, the top five middle linebacker position are actually correct for Madden 17. So that is it, guys. I don't want to talk about today. If you guys got any discussions about this, if you guys want to talk about Navarro Bowman, leave it in the comment section, guys. I'll read them later. So that is it. Subscribe for more, guys. If you guys want to see more Madden 17 strategies, tips, gameplays, more situations like this, more controversies. And also, heads up, guys, I'll be working on NFL news. So that's a probably a new series that's going to be coming up over the next few weeks. So check us out, guys. Subscribe for more. If you guys want to see more Madden 17 and also NFL news. Doesn't like what he sees on the defensive side, so he is changing the play to the receivers by giving him hand signals. One-handed catch.